Okay, you are in for a real treat today. Do you know what you're in for? I'm going to take you on the day in the life of what I do here in Oxford. It promises to be an amazing journey, and I hope you enjoy it. I'll probably tick off a lot of people today. Okay, this is the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. And this is our bedroom. And I'm going to leave now. And I'm going to, when I get on the bus, I'll probably pause for a while. And then I'll come back. I'll try to communicate with you what I'm doing. Turn off our light. Okay. Okay. So I'm cutting through. And I'm walking over to the parking right now. And this is where I hop on the green city center bus. Bought a passport last week. It's exciting stuff. And we'll be on the bus shortly. This is the park and ride for the pear tree roundabout. Which anytime you need to get here, you just tell the people on the bus, pear tree roundabout please. And they take care of business. It's usually they're waiting, but nope, it is. But by the time I get up there, it'll be gone. But momentarily, another shuttle will come in its place. And I'll be on my way. I'm actually really surprised that it's waiting for me. Huh. Interesting. Good morning. Afternoon. Oh. Afternoon. Afternoon, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> downtown to city center and these are just like some houses some residential neighborhoods that I'm passing so it's just kind of kind of average they have little flats everywhere around here oh but he's gonna make you sick a lot of boys and girls schools that was squishy lane <laughs> little flat pretty close together very expensive. Um, we just passed the Dragon at Preparatory School. Keep going. around here really amazing building they're gonna stop in front of the wine shop and I thought that I would take us down I'm gonna get something to eat today from the grocery store which is called Shane's Berries and I'll take us there and show you some of the food and then go sit by the, the fountain and eat watch some people go by um, it's a little bit busy it's touristy in this section if you walk like a mile away it's not as touristy we're coming up on Devon Heights, which we're going to pass, but this is like the department store up here. And that's where I go and get my bus pass. And here's things various where we're going to go. Um, a local grocery. So we'll see you in a minute. Here's the main area in Oxford. And we'll walk down that way after we go to the grocery store. We're about to stop. This is where Brian and I eat. This is the grief. And we're going to go down. Okay. It's a theater. She was alright. I'm going to 
I really like the looks of this place. It's called the Great. I don't know why I like it. It's like a restaurant pub. I keep wanting to go in there. That's the thing. I always almost get hit because, as you can see, they're on the left side. And I stay on the right side. And then I cut over, thinking I'm safe. And I almost get hit. Anyway, we're almost to the grocery. This is local Magdalene Street, as in Mary. And we're going into the grocery now. They have these really cute little foods here where you can eat like little portion control. Look, you can get like little sushis. Oh, it's like 79 pounds, too. It's pretty good. And they have like these little sandwiches. They have chicken and sweet corn, chicken and stuffing, chicken and pickle, egg mayonnaise and sausage, yummy, cheese, tuna and sweet corn, um, smoked ham and mustard. Usually they're very, really, 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 really weird. This isn't even a weird selection. Um, King, they have king prawn and rocket, plowman sandwiches, super big, Thai. So as you can see, you can like just pick up a regular sandwich, scotch egg, um, you can get like a, a bean salad. They have the nutritional values outright. Yesterday I got this. Tomatoes. They have a bunch of salads here. Tuna mixed bean, rainbow salad. Mark and crispies. And they have like vegetables. What I think is really cool is they have this pomegranate. Which is totally cut already. Yesterday I had mango fingers. All right, I'll kind of go down the other aisle so you can see, but um, this is a smaller grocery. It's actually no, this is a smaller one. I should have taken you into the big M&S one. Um, section. As you can see, they have their eggs sitting out here. That's lovely. Yogurt, as they call it. Parmigiano Reggiano. Got lots of cheeses. They're big on Baby Bell here. Baby Bell. Um, I don't know. All the different kinds of meats. A lot of Indian food, a lot of curry, a lot of tuna. They're gonna get in the way of these people's tuna. And that's it. I'm gonna go check out, and then the next time I see you, we'll be sitting and watching. Okay. Okay. Done eating. Now let's walk down this way. This is like the main street in Oxford. But there's a lot of streets, especially down by all the different colleges. There's tons of different colleges. I think there's like 15. Brian and I ate there the other day. As I'm walking down the street, you see there's like a, a lot of um, big, huge buildings. And there's the small building. What I actually think I'm going to do is I'm going to turn around and go to the opposite end and go somewhere I haven't before.
So this is just her 360 of the town. 